previously on Project Zomboid. Okay, yeah, it looks like we've got four crops of potatoes to harvest here, and they are at the seed bearing phase. Go ahead and harvest this, and this. All right, let's harvest this as well. More food for our salads. Lots and lots of food now. That spring has arrived. Let's go breed uh, some cows. Breed cows. What do we want to go for? A male or a female? We we'll go for one of each. There we go. There we go. I had another suggestion for us to maybe turn some of our trapped animals into jerky, homemade jerky. So I think that's what we'll end the episode off today with. Making some marinade and I assume we can make uh, jerky out of the uh, the birds. Okay, so we'll need some basic marinade uh, or we can make some tasty marinade. Okay, we got a jar, we got that. Soy sauce. We don't have any soy sauce though, guys. Oh, we need soy sauce. Hmm, never mind. We need to hit up some of those restaurants. Find some soy sauce. Hello everyone, my name is Nomis and welcome back to another episode of Project Zomboid. We are picking up here in our garden shortly after the events of our last episode. And it looks like we've got some more crops to harvest here, so that's what we're going to start things off with. Got some seed bearing t uh, potatoes. And I'll just open up our skill menu here. We might make it uh, to level 7 farming today. Let's go ahead and start harvesting. Looks like we got five crops of potatoes to harvest. And there might be one or two other crops as well. Maybe some cabbage. Yeah, we'll, we'll definitely hit level seven uh, farming today. Grab this one. We have so many potatoes. We are gonna be doing a cooking episode tomorrow. Focusing on uh, cooking a bunch of different meals. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Yeah, seed bearing cabbage. Grab that. Okay, so close to leveling up. I think I see one more crop back here. To grab. Is this cabbage as well? Yes, it is. Is that enough to level up? Oh, just barely. Alright, level 7 farming, guys. We are getting close to that level 10. We will be able to make or start uh, farming with potted plants so that will be cool and I had a comment from Hydromancer uh, regarding the coolers which we uh, were looking at uh, in a previous episode and I guess to use the cooler you gotta just right click on them and go turn on cooler so we are gonna try this um, let's see we'll go turn on cooler Okay, so that should be on. Let's turn this one on too. Turn off cooler, turn on cooler. Cool. Uh, right now you don't need the ice packs, I guess. But whatever, we'll keep one in there. Uh, just because. We'll go ahead and equip this primary. And let's take the food that we just harvested. Mainly the potatoes. And let's just, oh, 40 potatoes. Jesus. Let's just jam these coolers full of potatoes. As many as we can fit in each. Oh, we can fit all 40 in there. Oh, that's the perfect size. Nice. Okay, so... This should be... Uh, refrigerating now. Turn off, turn on. Okay. Uh, so, w let's just put this on the ground here. We'll come back uh, at the end of the episode. And see if uh, it seems to be working. I don't know. We'll see how that works. All right, let's put these seeds away. Uh, like I said uh, at the end of last episode, we're gonna be spending today going out uh, on a looting run, looking for some cooking uh, items, uh, specifically soy sauce, so we can make that tasty marinade. 120 potato seeds, Jesus. All right, let's pack that up, put that away. And let's see, 16 cabbages, hey? They don't last for very long. Maybe we should put the cabbages in our other cooler. 
equip that primary. I got a lot of bunches of berries, uh, so we can probably just eat those today. Not worry about making salads. Right, let's put this one down too. Okay, so before we head out, uh, let's drop off a few of these things in our pack dog. Just free up all the room we can. Uh, let's put the junk in there for now. Two empty bottles. We can fill those up when we're out. We'll keep our great sword with us. Let's just put uh, the axe on the ground. Ah, we might want an axe in case we need to break in somewhere. So I guess we'll keep that. Uh, the broken hunting knife, though, that can go on here. We've been holding on to that for a while. And let's see here. I think I actually have some sheep poop, too. Yeah, so we'll uh, search for a sheep uh, before we head out. Let's put this grass back. Okay. Let's grab our Bernese. Do a quick search. Oh, I need some rope. Maybe we'll get lucky today. All right, grab one of those. So we'll be heading down the highway uh, to check out. There's a burger stand uh, nearby, as well as uh, that pancake house. And we'll probably head back to the Spiffos. I think we grabbed everything from there. There might have been a couple containers we didn't get to. Because there was that gunshot, if you remember from last time. Uh, no sheep. Alright, that's a bust. We'll find one eventually, guys. Alright, five or 350. Uh, that's a little bit late in day. Let's, um... Here, we'll just we'll go out and do some foraging. And we'll head out uh, on our looting run first thing in the morning. Take advantage of a full day. I haven't done any more work on the walls in between episodes, so... Still at the same state they were last time around. Let's pop this open. Uh, foraging won't be upgraded anytime soon here. Uh, maybe, maybe we can find some more sheep poop, though. Before the day is out. Keep searching here. Alright, finding some things. Check over here. A little bit more. Forage, forage, forage. Uh, a couple things of deer poop. 14. Just looking at our, uh, our weight in our main inventory. You can see it going up there. Alright, that's good. What do we find here? Some berries, we'll make... Can't we make more bunches of berries? No? I think these white ones... These white ones are poisonous, aren't they? I think they are. Let's just drop those. And let's just eat these berries, I guess. Take a look, see if we found any... Sheep poop. Monarch butterfly. No sheep poop. All right. Let's get the stuff dropped off. And we'll get to bed and head out in the morning. I'll just edit here and we'll come back uh, once we are on the highway. Here we are on the highway. Just uh, sneaking past these first couple groups. Uh, not sure if we're gonna be able to make it past this one without them seeing us. We'll try. Oh no, there's some already here that have seen us. Right, let's try and take care of these couple. There we go. Oh, that actually went a little bit better than I expected. Alright, I don't think we've checked out that uh, mechanic shop there. Uh, that might be worth a, a look at some point. There could be some steel pipes in there. Our first spot that we're going to check, or try to check, is down here. There's a burger stand. Uh, there are quite a few zombies around, though. So, I'm not sure how we're going to do this.
It might not be possible to check this one out. We might just be heading down to the Pancake House. So there are quite a few here. Yeah, too many. Too many. Well, this is the Pancake House right here. Will we even be able to get into here? I don't know. I don't know, guys. I mean, I could get in there, but... It's, it's um... Yeah, there's so many. Uh... What to do, what to do. Let's keep heading down to the Spiffos, I guess. So we search this zippy mark. Yeah, it's a bit quieter down here. But I think we searched all this stuff already. Huh? There's a group coming out of there. Those guys are coming down. Oh, they stopped. At least. Okay. Avoid that group. Just hop around here. Oh god. Okay, I'll take care of these three instead of that big group. Gotta get some cooking supplies. Yeah, I think there was a fridge or two that we didn't get around to checking in the uh, spiffers. Uh, this, uh, oh, damn it. I don't know. Maybe we'll need to just head into some residential areas a bit further south. Did we open this door? Oh, we didn't. Oh, yeah, I think we're gonna have to try and get into some residential areas. So many zombies down here. Let's try down here. Hopefully it's not as bad. Okay, just a... Uh, there's a few up here. Let's try. Come on. Alright. Stay down. Yeah, some antidepressants, sure. Okay, we're good. Into the greenhouse. Looks kind of empty. See a broken window in the back corner there. Could be some zombies inside. Although it looks pretty good. Let's just close this. Oh, what do we got in here? Calligraphy. Interesting. Gardening, hunting, sericulture. Have not read that. Okay. Trapping for beginners. Oh, there we go. We've been looking for you, sir. Uh, we are also going to be picking up some uh, utensils. So I had some comments saying that we could be smelting these down. So let's grab uh, um, butter knives, uh, spoons, forks, that kind of stuff. Take some food too. We can always use more food. And bleach. Uh, cereal we can use for trapping. Hot sauce, there we go. Italian herbs, excellent. Another medium battery. More food. I'm sure we have a rolling pin, hey? Let's take one just in case. Flour. Good. Butter knife. Some pasta. Empty short glass. Let's start taking some of these glasses for making cocktails later on. Take that pasta too. Alright, let's fill up some of these empty bottles. Okay. Uh, did we check this one? Nope. 
Baking pan, okay, cooking oil, chips, empty tall glass, fork, kitchen knife, tea bag, whiskey. Well, that's all good stuff. Uh, bacon, even though it's rotten, we can slice that up, get some uh, cooking experience. Donut. Donut, pickle, ice cream, yes, delicious. Frying pan can be smelted down, fork, salt, more chips, awesome, okay. No soy sauce, but uh, some good loot regardless. If we have enough space left over, we'll try and pick up those uh, pallets of MREs that we came across in the other episode. More bleach. Uh, we'll grab this dead mouse because we can cut that up, get some experience. Uh, the sheets. Uh, I don't think we really need the sheets. Let's fill up a couple more bottles here. Go. Empty bottle. Perfect. Okay. Well, that was a pretty good find. In that house. Okay, there's a bit. Uh, let's start taking out some of these guys. I was going to say, there's a bit too many here, but... I suppose if we have the opportunity to kill zombies, we should be taking it. There we go. Oh, a survival axe. Yes, please. And found a survival axe on a zombie in a while. Don't really find that many weapons on zombies these days. Okay. Check that shed out. It might have a. If, we, if we're lucky, it could have a, a stage one beehive. If we're lucky. Okay, one down. These ones are fast. Another one down. Beginning to lose a little bit of durability in this steel hatchet, but it's been uh, pretty good so far. I like it. All right, let's just. Uh, right, so there are a couple back there. Let's try and remove this glass. Get it in this way. Hopefully, there's just one inside here. Oh, and I got shot. Alright, where's that taking people? Down that direction, okay. Alright, let's uh, quickly search this. Take your key. Hammer, we'll take the thread. Uh, lighter fluid, machete, pumpkin seeds, twine, take all that stuff. Okay. Let's try and get in this house. All the zombies are migrating. Close the curtains. Got a broken door on the back. We got one zombie in here. Two zombies in here. They haven't... Oh. Oh, God. Where the hell did you come from? That was close. She could have easily bit us there. We gotta take care of this guy. Alright, we gotta search this quick. Uh, basketry, fungi. I'm gonna start taking more of these uh, foraging books. Okay. Let's check the kitchen quickly. Another kitchen knife. Roasting pan. Okay. Uh, let's take the canned tomatoes. Sure, we could use that in uh, ingredients. Chili powder, garlic powder, awesome. Butter knife and spoon. Butter knife, chips, cleaning liquid, fork. I know we use cleaning liquid uh, for a recipe, for like making like a chlorine bomb or something like that. Uh, start taking more wax paper too. 
No soy sauce yet. Oh god. Okay. Abort. <laughs> Abort. Alright, we're gonna need to find somewhere to sleep here. Our bag's about three quarters full. Um, hmm, where are we gonna sleep? Not up here. Too many zombies. Lots of pink, uh, pink leaves on the trees. Oh yeah, that's a, that's a big group. All right, maybe we can push in. Hmm, they're still moving south. Let's push down here. There's another shed up there. Um, here, let's just push down a couple blocks. Hopefully there's somewhere to sleep. Right, let's go down here. Seems pretty quiet. A uh, couple zombies. That day went by pretty quick. Alright, this house looks like it's probably safe. So let's take out these two zombies. That are following us. Now we're a bit tired here. Alright, come on. Oh god. Stay back. Stay up. Stay back. <laughs> Stay down. There we go. One down. Another one coming. Come on, fall down. Before this guy gets here. Damn it. Oh, damn it. Alright. There we go. Perfect. Oh, another machete. Ooh, we're finding a, a few. Good weapons on zombies today. Thank you. Alright, let's grab something to eat here. Got a bit of salad here. Uh, let's eat a quarter of that. Okay, we'll just eat the whole thing then. Still hungry. Some berries. And another quarter. And <laughs> another quarter. There we go. Alright, hopefully there's no one in here. Need to find that soy sauce. Alright, any soy sauce in here? More medium batteries. Give me some soy sauce. Seeds. Uh, lemon juice. Okay, that's good. The lemon too. A jar of sauerkraut. Interesting. No soy sauce though. Uh, do we need any of this stuff? Plumbing, we've read that. Viticulture, we've read that. Pharmacology, uh, just in case we don't have that one. I think we do though. I know we have the anarchist uh, cookbook. All right, looks like we're sleeping here. Oh, there's a zombie right there. All right, she hasn't seen us. An alarm clock. All right, let's get to bed here. Sleep for eight hours. Uh, we've got a bit of a heavy load here. It's probably the, all that water we're carrying. Let's uh, drop one in our pack, or maybe uh, we'll put three in our pack here. That should lighten the load for him. All right, so we can carry 14 more units. Let's see what we can find. Might as well just keep filling up, please. Oh, can't fill up the water bottle, just drink. Okay. Uh, let's leave that open. So we know we've been here. Let's check this house. Someone's gotta have soy sauce. It's not that rare of a, I don't know, you wouldn't really call it a condiment, would you? That rare of an ingredient? What 
we got here? Advanced trapping. Sure, we'll take that. Pickled ginger. All right, chips, energy bar. Like those canned sardines. Salami we'll take. Tea bag. Apples, I guess we could use if we wanted to make like an apple pie. Sure. Uh, I'll leave that frying pan there. Uh, we have cookie cutters. Take the fork. Uh, we'll take the spray can for the garden. Nine mil bullets. Okay. Chips. Damn, no soy sauce. Nothing in there. Uh, more books. Industrial mechanics. We've read that. A sailing textbook, hey? Interesting. Tree field guide. Okay, so we just need the flower field guide and we'll have a, a complete second set of those uh, foraging books. Wire hanger we can smelt. Oh, what do we got here? A box of nails, good. Always could use more nails. All right, that's it for this house. Um, let's see here. I suppose there could, oh, there's quite a few there. Just gonna check that garbage can, but we'll leave that. All right, how about this big house? This looks like a soy sauce fan. Just waiting for that next alarm. It's been a while. Coffee, another spoon. Uh, more donuts. Ice cream, delicious. Actually, let's have some ice cream. Have a treat. Where is the ice cream? There we go. Soft serve ice cream. Eat all that. Okay, a mop, some more cereal. Our fork. Butter knife, fork. A light bulb. I think we can recycle these into glass. Doesn't weigh very much. Take that. Sponge. I don't know, we might need that for an ingredient and a recipe. Possibly. Tortilla chips, we can use that for making nachos, I think. Chips, carrot seeds, a box of MREs. Uh, we don't really need that. I'm not gonna worry about that one. I'll take the fork and the spoons though. Okay. Notebook will take. All right, let's fill up our water bottle. Uh, anything in here? Plastic hanger, no. No zombies in these homes. Don't need the cooking for intermediates. Oh, a radio textbook. We probably will need that come the next build when they add in radios. I could see that being useful down the road. Vacuum cleaner, nine mil. Okay, we are full now. Can we fit the nine mil? Uh, we can fit a few. I'll take that stuff. All right, no soy sauce. Damn. Guess we won't be making jerky. We'll have to uh, think of a few other items to uh, cook up. Nothing there. Take a look at a couple more homes though. Uh, what do we got here? Looks like a store of some sort. 
Ooh, a food market. Ooh. We're over here, hey? Maybe we'll find soy sauce in here. Italian herbs. Okay, let's um, drop something here. Something we don't really need. Uh, let's drop the frying pan. Don't really need that. Let's butcher this. We can drop that meat since it's rotten. Here, we'll just uh, get bacon rashers. Yeah, use up that. All right, let's grab this herb. And we'll eat some lollipop. Vegetables, vegetables. Come on, soy sauce. Sandbag, take that. Shiitake mushrooms. I always gotta take the pickles. We like our pickles. All right, no soy sauce, damn it. <laughs> um, 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 um. Garbage bag. Uh, let's check these other garbages. Eraser, nah. Well, we might as well check this shed. We'd be happy if we find some, some beehives. That would make up for not finding our soy sauce. A rope, blue ornament, more twine. Duct tape was always good to have. Wire, hammer, nope. Yeah, let's check this. Just break the window. I don't think there's anyone around. Okay. Uh, sausage making, we've read that. Ring stand, fishing tackle. Another lighter. A drill head, okay. We will need one of these if we ever find a a uh, portable drilling unit, a uh, mining unit. Uh, so I am going to take that. Uh, <laughs> swing wildly. Oh, they were hiding behind the corner, hey? Waiting to sneak up on us. And that's why you should always clear a house first before you start looting. <laughs> you were a little lazy there. Okay, nothing else. Uh, more spoons. Uh, cookie jar, let's just open this up. Okay. Uh, get bacon bits. That'll get us even more experience. Uh, we're gonna hold on to this stuff because we can cook that up and get quite a bit of experience from it. Junk will drop though. What kind of cookies did we get? Uh, small animal and meat will drop. Some white chocolate chip cookies. Cool. Oh, there's some beef jerky. There, we don't have to make it. We found some. It's all good. Our chocolate donut. Yeah, we'll take that. Uh, lime, sure. I'm not sure if we can plant limes, but just in case we can. Alright, we're just going to take a few more items here. Oh, vinegar. Yeah, definitely want that. Uh, 10 mil rounds will take. We could probably box up some of those rounds now. Fork, another lighter, spoon. Gummy bears, we'll just eat that. More spoons, strawberries. Coffee. Yeah, we're pretty uh, overweight now, so we're going to have to call it, I think. Clear the rest of these rooms. Oh, bathroom zombie. 
Not today. Hairspray will take. Right, no one in here. A top hat. Someday we'll be able to wear those. Someday. All right, guys. That was a big bust as far as uh, soy sauce goes. But we found uh, quite a bit of other good items. Got a fair amount of utensils. We should be able to smelt down to uh, get some more ingots. Another good food run, regardless. Uh, some more cereal. What else we get here? That was kind of cool. Flour is always good, although we can make our own flour. Got some hot sauce, some Italian herbs. Uh, Italian herbs, that'll be good for making uh, like pizza sauce. Uh, we could, uh, let's look up a, a few recipes here before we end the episode. All right, what do we need to make some pizza? Make boring pizza, pizza stone, pizza dough, bowl of tomato sauce. Let's see, tomato a sauce. Tomatoes, soft Italian herb, garlic powder. Yeah, so we can make that. We could probably make some pizza. Was there a pizza stone? Do we have a pizza stone? I know I know we saw one today. Hopefully we have one back home. So we could make some pizza. We could make Let's see what else we got here. Something interesting, hey? Some lasagna. Yeah, we could make some lasagna. Cause we could we could uh, harvest some broccoli and uh, some tuna. We we have tuna. We could do broccoli and tuna. Oh, and and one of cheddar cheese or cheese. We don't have any cheese. Never mind, we can't do lasagna. Uh, baked potatoes we could do though. Let's favorite that. Let's favorite, what else? What else can we make? We can make some rice. Oh, uh, we don't have any eggs though. All right, not rice. Or not cooked rice. Fried rice, I should say. Chili. We have beef jerky, we have garlic powder. Pot of fresh rice and beans. Yeah, we could probably make chili. Okay, let's favorite that. Rice and beans we can make. Let's favorite that. So we could always harvest some tomatoes. Risotto. Yeah, we could do this one too. Could always forage for some mushrooms or uh, use broccoli. Cracked nuts, yeah, we could definitely do that. We have a bunch of hickory nuts. That's not really not really cooking, but I guess it would go towards our cooking skill. Uh, nothing to do with honey or drying. So we need more baking pans for that. Or baking trays. Uh, we could do. What else can we do? We can make more bug stew if we really wanted to. Uh, fill chili, chili, chili. Bowls, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fried egg, nope. Can't do that. So many cooking recipes. Let's see, juicing, no, no, no. All right, let's scroll down here, get to more food items. Okay, uh, barbecue, nope. Blueberry pie. Oh, we can make a pie. Should we try and make a pie? We could try and make a pie. Tasty pasta. Cooked tasty pasta. Bread dough. We can make bread. Let's favorite that. Bunch of berries. Uh, make cake. We can make a cake. Oh, we don't have an egg. 
Can't do that. Burrito. Don't have cheese. Uh, cookies. We could, oh, I don't have a baking tray. How about this? Corned beef taco. We have can. I think we have corned beef. We might have some corned beef still. Taco sauce. Mayonnaise. We don't have mayonnaise. Hmm. Yeah, a lot of these recipes you wouldn't be able to make because, uh, like, the mayonnaise stuff is all rotten. Enchiladas? No, that uses cheese. Fish taco. Obviously uses fish. French fries? We can make french fries, okay. That's good. Gingerbread man cookie. We can make... Nope. Bacon tray. Bacon tray. Guac? Nope. Pancakes? Uses eggs. Can't do that yet. Jarring. Nachos. Nacho cheese. Make peach pie. Yeah, we can make some pie. We can make some pie. Or one of these types of pies we can make. Depending on what we have canned. Uh, so pie crust. We will make our favorite. Yeah, there we go. Pie dough we can definitely make. Soups, pancakes, pumpkin bread dough. That sounds pretty cool. Make a dang quesadilla. Nope, we need cheese. Renee, nope, we need uh, a meat cleaver so we can get intestines. That'd be cool to go down that road. Once we're able to. Same with all the sausage. So much, so much stuff to make. Oh, what else? Get near the end here. Here's some of these fancy drinks. Rum. Haven't even seen any rum. Uh, we need to start collecting more types of alcohol. Alright, opening cans. Uh, nothing there. Nothing there I really want. Alright, well we favorited a few. I think we're... I think that's pretty good. Let's see what we got favorited here. We got baked potatoes. We've got chili, risotto, cracked nuts, bread, french fries, pies, and yeah. So that's probably what we'll be making next episode, guys. That'll uh, do it for today. Thanks a lot for watching. I hope you enjoyed our little... Uh, looting adventure run. I was lucky no one <laughs> came in and bit us while we were uh, preoccupied searching through that uh, list of items. But uh, yeah, come back tomorrow for a uh, dedicated cooking episode. Leave me some comments below uh, for what you think uh, the next cooking episode should uh, include. Or we, what we should try and find uh, to make uh, next time. Uh, but I probably won't see your comments uh, before I record the next episode, but yeah guys, thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, I'll talk to you all later. Uh -huh.